With nearly 2 million people who attend the Minnesota State Fair each year, you are bound to come across some familiar faces. Our Josh Peterson found some hometown 4-H members that are becoming the friendly face of 4-H. With an estimated 1.9 million people at the Minnesota State Fair, you are bound to bump into some people you know. Welcome to the 4-H building. Hope you guys enjoy. For Taylor and Taylor, who are from both Beltrami and Crow Wing counties, they are the faces that will greet you when you stop by the 4-H building at the fair. The two Taylors are part of the Ambassador Program, which is a top honor for 4-H youth looking to take that next step. Oh, the Minnesota State Ambassadors are a group about of about 30 youth that are high school um, juniors, seniors, and college freshmen that come together and um, they're first at the state fair where they um, you know, get to interact with the public and explain what 4-H is. One of the many duties of the 4-H ambassadors here at the state fair is to greet people at the 4-H building and answer many of their questions. We're right by the main gate. We've gotten a lot of questions on what a state ambi is um, or an ambassador and also um, what the 4-H's stand for, what 4-H means to us. So it's going to be through the double doors on either side and up on the second floor on the stage. Where's the bathroom? Where's the education building? Uh, where's the barns? I've gotten that one before. The ambassador program is all about taking that next step. For Taylor, she was up to the challenge and looking forward to sharing her passion for the 4-H program with others. And this is my first year ever trying to do anything on a state level for leadership, so this is kind of cool for me and a brand new learning experience. Taylor also felt that it was a huge honor and a great opportunity to get an in-depth state fair experience that requires many long days. Fair time is my favorite time. It's the most chaotic, but it's the most fun. You make the best memories when you're kind of half asleep and uh, wanting fair food. So when you're at the state fair, stop by the 4-H building and say hello, because you never know that smiling face greeting you. Thanks for coming. Maybe from your very own hometown. In Pelkin Heights at the Minnesota State Fair, I'm Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. 4-H ambassador work goes beyond the state fair. Once the fair is over, the ambassadors will begin work on a youth leadership conference. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.